AdamandEve.com. I'm talking toys, bondage, lingerie, and so much more. Plus, they have 24-7 customer service, so you can order at 3 a.m. if you ain't coming, if you get me, okay? And if something isn't working out, you can send it back within 90 days, no hassle. And if that's not enough, you can also take pleasure in knowing that 20% of their profits goes to help fight the spread of HIV around the world. So go on ahead and log on to AdamandEve.com. Use the code Tasha K for 50% off one item plus free shipping in the U.S. and Canada. Some exclusions apply now, but hurry up and visit AdamandEve.com so they can make you come. I wonder why the hell so many people are trying to tell me to slow down. Seems like motherfuckers should be shutting the hell up and enjoying the show. <sighs> I'm already hot. Now, now... I, I literally feel scared even talking about her on the screen. I don't even know why they they showed this picture. It looks like she's staring right at me. Now, anybody who digs up their dead cat, placed the cat in a plastic bag, dug the cat in the backyard of the home that is now being foreclosed on, boiled him in the crab pot, the collard green pot. She probably washed it with some Dawn soap and put it right back under the sink. She going to cook it in her next house. Now, I had to make a phone call because I ain't never seen or heard or no shit like this. And so I made a phone call to somebody that dibble and dabble in this kind of stuff. And I said, why would she be cooking her cat in her kitchen, her dead cat in her kitchen? It's like she preserved him in that plastic bag. Now, he hadn't had been dead long because she boiled all the fur, put it in a bucket with some money. Uh, would she have a bottle of wine? She had all types of stuff in, in, in the bucket after she done bought the cat skinless. Now I'm like, I, I don't know who her witch doctor is or what rituals um, that these folks done gave her, but I'm trying to figure out, like, her album? I, I can't tell you. Please, please, ask yourself, can you think of one song? One song! Teddy? Can anybody think of one song that Azalea Banks has made all the while she's been cutting up chickens and boiling cats on the internet, I will wait. She needs a new witch doctor. Okay, she needs a new witch doctor. Um, if anybody's in the comments that can give her some, uh, give her a witch or, or know of a witch that can really uh, bring some good fruit to her life, Beyonce, <laughs> please holler at her, girl. Please holler at her. I know she shaved her head bald. I mean, she did a lot of crazy shit, and the bank's still coming to get that house. She should have bought the, the, the president at the bank, okay? That's the one that she need the damn ball, not the cat. He the one taking her damn house back and shit. Mm -hmm. That's who she need to ball. Pray to, sprinkle some salt around the bitter. Don't ask me how I know. <laughs> Don't ask me about no, but get on, get the devil off the screen. She and this devil, I don't know. Look, I'm sending these good energy waves out here. Breaking up the energy, the way she was looking at me. <sighs> bow wow, bow wow, bow wow. I, I don't think anybody, listen, I don't like gloat in people's like, um, what do you call it? shortcomings per se, especially financially, because we've all been there. You know, I filed bankruptcy. You know what I'm saying? I've been broke, eating noodles, been homeless, you name it. Okay, I've been there. I know what it's like, and I don't wish anybody, not even my worst enemy, to be there. But Bow Wow, I don't understand how is it that your mama manages everything, and you on the internet right now calling out your friend's girlfriend, because you can't get in contact with him for $7,000 that he owes you from a dice game for two years, from two years ago. Now, that's that's a different type of broke. That's, you know, I'm looking at my phone to see who got what I need. Why can't he call up, like, you know, Kanye West? Why can't he call up um, Masika? Hell, the real BB Judy, all of them got PPD loans. Everybody. Pretty Ricky. What's that dude name from Pretty Ricky Jasmine? Um, pretty, not pretty. Was it Blue? Was it Blue? They got the $1 million. 
I know some of his friends out here scamming. Shit, just for a little bit. You just take a little bit out the PP law, buy what you need, buy you a first class ticket. You know? Still telling lies, sitting on coach, posting pictures of um, what you call them, private jets and shit. I mean, it's like he living by the wish factor. This man made so much goddamn money. Where is it? Sue your mama. Do something. So that's okay to sue your mama. You can go back, request everything, and every damn tax return will become yours if she mismanaged that shit. Because there's no way you should be, as an icon, begging for $7,000 from a man's girlfriend. You bullying this woman on the internet. All because you trying to take that shit to the damn strip club. I know exactly what he was going to do. I knew what he was going to do. Get this off the screen. He may, it may be contagious, the brokenness. Move it on. Move it on. Now, before we move on, we got some sponsors that we need to brag about.